Hello everyone, welcome to Shri Voyage. Today I'm going to be going over all things coral and orange. I pulled 15 lipsticks ranging from gloss, balm textures, cream, and matte. And the goal today is to find a shade that works for your skin tone and just have some fun playing with this really fun, beautiful, vibrant color. Let's get started. Now I personally like color symbology. So what does the color coral represent? It's considered a dynamic and invigorating as well as a warm color and how it affects our mood. It brings in playfulness and joy as well as fun. Coral is the color really to me of summer. It's a color I wear year round, but it looks best in the summertime, usually because our skin gets a little bit more gold, a little bit more warm. So the color of coral against that gold tan skin really is gorgeous. Now for those of you who are thinking, I don't tan, I burn, don't worry. I am gonna show you guys a color that will work beautifully for your skin tone. So I have 15 lipsticks to try on with you guys. I went through my very, very large stash of lipsticks, specifically corals, and have everything from glosses to cream lipsticks to matte lipsticks. And I'm gonna go over with you guys what coral is the best if you're light skinned medium skinned or deep skin toned. Let's get started. If you're fair to light skinned, a true pink undertone, you want to complement your skin tone by going for more of a coral with a pink in it. One of the most beautiful colors to me is like a soft salmon pink for those of you with truly light skin. And I have talked about this, but for those of you who have not seen my other videos, if you do not know if you are cool or warm toned, take a look at your veins, if they lean a little bit more towards the blue side, you are cool. If they look a little more green, you are warm. If you cannot tell, most likely you're a neutral. For those of you with fair skin heading towards the warmer undertones, head into more light corals, with kind of an orangey base to it. So a really light tomato orangey red would look gorgeous on you. Or a subtle peach color will look lovely as well. For those of you with truly medium skin tone, head towards a vivid or really gorgeous bright coral color, but try to find something with some gold like flex in it to really highlight the gold in your skin or the warm color in your skin, but definitely head towards something bolder and much more vibrant to really play off of your skin tone. For those of you who are medium skin tone and more on the deeper side, head towards a pink orange. You want that really soft rosy pink with that bright orange to play gorgeously off of your skin tone. For those of you with dark skin, head towards a reddish coral. Tomato orange colors are stunning on your skin tone. Something that's warm and yet bright. Now for those of you with truly deep skin tone, go as bold and as bright orange or orangey red as possible. Oh my goodness, those colors are insanely gorgeous on your skin tone. So definitely think the bolder, the brighter, the better. All right, are we ready? Let's try on 15 lipsticks. I'm gonna start off first with two lip tints, one for light to medium skin and medium to deep skin. These types of sheer balm textures are great for those of you who are a bit intimidated by color or who wanna try coral and have never tried it before. I wanna dip your toe in and see if it's a color that you can wear day to day. All right, next we're gonna head into the lip glosses and I have seven lip glosses to try with you guys. And I picked a lot of glosses because I find that corals are probably the most flattering and over my 25 year career as a makeup artist, the most reached for from clients. I feel like they can experience coral without it being too overwhelming to them. Also, glosses are fantastic because they give a fuller look and as we wear most of these kind of coral lipsticks during 
fall and summer, sometimes spring as well, they are perfect texture with that kind of suntan, dewy look that we get on our skin, and it just plays really nicely off of each other. All right, so let's go ahead and try on these seven lip glosses. All right, this next section of coral lipsticks are cream kind of satin formulations. These are going to get much more bold because they're much more pigmented than the balms as well as the glosses. So for those of you who want something that's a little bit more wow, this section's for you. All right, so we're down to the last section. I have three matte lipsticks to try on for you guys. Now these are going to be the most saturated as well as the most drying. So for those of you who want a really great bold lip, head towards matte. But for those of you that don't like the texture of something that is more on the dry side, then I'd head towards more of the cream lipstick formulation.
we made it 15 coral lipsticks. Hopefully in this video, you found a shade of lipstick that will work best for your skin tone and a formulation that grabbed your attention. If you guys have any questions or suggestions, feel free to comment down below. And if you want to support Shri Voyage, all you need to do is subscribe, hit that like button, and go ahead and use the affiliate links provided. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye everyone.